There we go. My recording got too long. I had to stop it. It was at the limit of like what an episode would be, so I had to like cut it like hard. <laughs> Stepping off. Will do. Hey, almost. I can cover it. <laughs> Hey, I guess you haven't seen somebody have a 96% chance to hit and miss. <laughs> I'm on the move. <laughs> I can't remember the last time my troops were proficient. <laughs> you watching? Take this. Come and blow. Take this grenade, ho! Oh wow, they lived through it. They're on to me. Whoops, buddy. No way. I have faith in you. Damn. <clears throat> I've got eyes on that thing, Damn it! They heard the noise. And then they saw us. Oh, it's a rocketeer. I must improve my strengths. There. You, bro, all I imagine is you sitting there, like, with a list of problems and just reading them off, and he's down, and he's out of here, and he's going home. <laughs> Objective here. He, he's getting in his car, he's driving out of the parking lot, he's leaving, he's gone. <laughs> That's how I imagine how you're going. Oh, nice. Only a 49% chance to hit and still hit. A good decision. Like another one of yours? Oh no. Bro, my condolences, my friend. I'm with you in spirit. Already there. I said I was with you in spirit! I, I was there. being supportive! <laughs> Damn, bro. <laughs> that bad? C'est parti! I can do that. So oh, 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 oh. The, a gunner, a mech, and a viper. Ah, oh, man, I wish they stayed grouped up. Feel the power of the Templars. Fuck, man, damn. Um. On my way. Move one over. It hit the plate. Jive. There we go. Son armure tient le coup. Understood. Uh. Ooh, nice. Okay, sweet, sweet. <laughs> wow. <laughs> You're gonna get promoted, but we're losing this war, so it doesn't matter anyways. <laughs> oh shit, dude! The fucking robot's gun stuck in the fucking wall up here. Strike for my people. That's what I'm talking about, dude.
Yeah. Is it just this surveillance? It is, yeah. <sighs> You're not cool. You just have to start a new new game. Absolutely. Good shit. Oh, you said what happens if I lose? So I was just telling you. Get an evac in here. This is Firebrand. Evac request confirmed. Hold tight. No, you're not. You're feeling one emotion. Anger. <laughs> Depression. So I guess two. <laughs> I, hey, Emilio one time was like, you don't feel any emotions, you're a psychopath. And I'm like, yes I do. Anger and depression. <laughs> yeah, right. What? Why did it not? We need an evacuation. That's weird. Wait, did it? Do, do I have to kill them all? Evac request confirmed. So okay. weird. This is Firebrand. It's time to go. That's so weird. I'm next. Avengers, this is Firebrand. Package is secure. All XCOM operatives are secure. Firebrand is returning to base. What'd you say? Sorry. 25 minutes till what? Destruction left in their wake. XCOM refuses to Until let what? go of the ways of the old world. Oh. They will continue their wanton and wreck. <laughs> Glad to see our troops finding success in the field. It's good for the entire crew's morale. I accept. You're not accepting it, or are you accepting it? I don't. Yeah, I don't know what you're saying. <laughs> Bro, no way. Are you really doing that? <laughs> you're. Oh god, you're hilarious. I mean, you're not wrong. I can do this one. Setting course for Brazil. Four people, go, go, go. Sky Ranger deployed. Squad green to deploy. Hmm. It's an intel package. Okay. We can do Setting that. Setting course for Sector 11, West Africa. You said you lost? Why? <laughs> what happened to your element of surprise? Ranger deep. We're in the pipe. Oh. Five by five. Setting course for Eastern European Ward. Let's see how we doing on everything. Still got five days on that. 
Attempting to establish local regional contact. Four days on that. How much we got here? Five days still. It's an engineer. Two days. I, I can't make that, can I? I'm right here. I'm not gonna be able to make that. Yeah. This will prove to be an important step forward. There we go. Okay, what can we grab? Anything amazing? No. Shut up! <laughs> I will send word as soon as we have something of note. <laughs> Man, I don't know. Something else hit a hundred. Three days. Three days. Two days, okay. That one I can do. For the Eastern US precinct. Commander, you should be aware. We're detecting lost activity in this area. Our forces will need to be especially vigilant. There we go. Sky Ranger deployed. I think that's four squads out right now. Setting course for the Australian sector. I accidentally sent two snipers on the same mission. <laughs> Sky Ranger in position for deployment. Two days. Two days. One day. Yeah, if it's if he's mind controlled, he's the last one, he gets captured. Same if they're knocked unconscious or uh bleeding out and they haven't died yet. I believe. They just die. <laughs> My characters don't bleed out. They die. <laughs> Gotta say it like with confidence. We're expecting heavy resistance at the site, and the aliens have had extensive air support moving in that region that'll keep Firebrand grounded. Lock down the area. Eliminate. I'm a very I'm a very poor resistance, but I got a lot of contacts. Menace one five. We have a confirmed location for the VIP. Move to rendezvous. Eliminate all hostile contacts. Roger that. On my way. Orders confirmed. Moving out. Moving to position. A squad of vipers, bro. What'd you say? They're the snakes, bro. There's a squad of them. One guy's right in my crit zone, though. Who's keeping score? Weak hit. That's what I'm talking about. Get, get wiped. Yeah, okay, that guy's not gonna be in range of that. Braze. Uh. Oh shit! It hit. 
neutralized. Nice. Moving out. I've got eyes on advent troops. Hey, what's up, Mega? Yeah, it was. It was insane, man. Insane. Okay. I got my people fucking specced like so hard. Like, I have to make sure that people can do like as much damage as possible, as many times as possible in the same turn or over multiple turns because it's just it's so brutal. Long where they're chosen, like the, the second you make a mistake, like you're fucked. I learned that the hard way over the pe like previous like three or four attempts on Long War the Chosen. <laughs> I also didn't really fully understand how to play War of the Chosen, though, at the time. Roger that. Which I do now a lot better. Mm, I wouldn't say so. I wouldn't say so at all. I played Enemy uh, Within it, or Unknown, whichever one is the one with the all the DLC included and all of that. And XCOM 2 War of the Chosen plus Long War of the Chosen is definitely uh, more unforgiving. Because there's a lot of bullshit things that happen because of like different squads. Uh, so like the snake instantly grabs you, you can't do anything, which I think that might be another one. Uh, but then they have the drone, which is a Long War of the Chosen mod enemy, which can instantly stun you, uh, then destabilize you if you're already stunned. And then they have um, the Chosens who can capture you, they're the Chosen aliens who capture you and take you gone. Uh, no, but uh, everything that was in that was improved upon when it came into Long War of the Chosen for 2, so. Uh, I played base game, uh, veteran or, or higher difficulty on that. Uh, oh yeah, let's hit. But yeah, Long War of the Chosen for War of the Chosen, uh, Long War of the Chosen, yeah, <laughs> is literally taken from the first game and, and then made to apply for this one. <laughs> it's the same, same. Same, same. But, uh, two, okay, if you take base game, right, uh, Enemy Within or Enemy Unknown, and base game, uh, X-Home 2 or War of the Chosen, two is harder than the first one, in my opinion. And then if you take Long War for the first and Long War with the second, I have to assume that it still follows because they're the same mod just, you know, built around the each game's uh, engine, I guess is the correct term to say. Uh, yeah, we're going to go here. Copy that. It, it is. It is really dope. I, I love both games. They were a lot of fun. Oh, we got enemies right up there. It's like essentially Long War of the Chosen or Long War in any of them is uh, just a. Here we go. Yeah. No, not that. Wait. Precision shot? No, I'll just quick shot 100. There we go. I guess I will precision shot. I don't normally like games in this style, but there, there's more than a, a a couple games like this, like XCOM Enemy Within, XCOM 2, Phoenix Point. Uh, there's a few other games I think off the, that uh, I do I am a little bit interested in that are in the same style. Incoming over here. You said what? Yeah, I have no interest in the OG XCOM either. <laughs> Oh, I played a little bit of Mutant Year Zero, but I don't know if that was my thing. I gave it like a shot. I didn't really give it a hard. Ooh, ooh! I didn't really give it like a huge chance, but I don't know if that's really my style. Okay, we're gonna have to we're gonna have to take the person. Yeah, I can hit you with the pistol from here. One hundred crit. I can't take that 52 range, 81 chance. Nice. You can't handle me. Somebody's still up there on uh. Take the 53. Fuck, I missed. I'll get him next time. Training ammo fast. Okay, I can move. Ah, oh, fucking a. On, focus. Okay, we're just gonna we're gonna hunker down. 
yeah, Mew Near Zero. Like I said, I don't know if it's really my type of game. I, I, I tried it out and I was kind of interested in it, but I wasn't really loving it or anything. It was just like a small peak of interest, nothing else. Forty-three, fifty-three. I'm on it. How about now? We'll take the sixty-three. Shit. Negative damage. Got no ammo. Take the eighty-seven chance. Nice. Overwatch is removed. I can move my character now. The loot. Target asset located. What is it? Oh damn! You can't. I don't know. What's it called? The. Uh, I don't know what it's called. I haven't got those guys unlocked in my playthrough yet. Yeah, they're bad. <laughs> they're bad guys. <laughs> or are you talking about bad? Like they're hard to fight. Yeah, I, I I completely agree with you. Some I've missed a shot where it was like ninety six percent chance to hit. Located target assets. X ray neutralized. On the move. Go go go. Getting it done. Go. Dude, that guy's fro- look at it, look at his body, it's like frozen. Uh, look at it, look at this. Look, at, he's frozen in midair, like he died and he's supposed to be laying against something. But he's not. That, that's hilarious. Good to go. On my way. Yeah, I've done- I've done that a lot. I've had that a lot where I miss like every single shot with my entire squad. And I'm just mad because of that. Hope this is a hacker. I'll take the small cash, yeah. We're at the VIP in tow. Moving to evac. It's gonna suck if there's actually somebody up there. Roy. What does it look like? Propelling. Can you like uh, just hover over it and you'll see what its name is, bro? Roger that. I'm all over it. Y your person or his? Your person or his? Oops, I accidentally. Skip two turns. <laughs> Copy that. No, no, I was saying, you said that person died. You didn't say mine or an enemy died. Yeah. Double time. <laughs> that that's Moving that is uh, re extremely true. Got it covered. There we go. Let's Stepping hit that. Off. Gotta cover. And turn, get everybody over here. On the move. There Heading we out. go. Tired of waiting around. Oh, this is everybody. Okay. VIP I thought I had one more person not here. VIP is secure. Status confirmed. What'd you say? Operation what? <laughs> <laughs> that was what it was called? Was that the last mission you could do? And despite the destruction left in their wake, XCOM refuses to let go of the ways of the old world. Well, your people will, will still heal, so if you have any more, they will heal. Reckless crime. Wait, there's no more people at all? Excellent work, Commander. Your can you in the field have certainly Can you recruit more people? Oh. 
Oh, okay, okay. Hmm. Keep going to the bitter end, Halo. There's like a mission where you do that. But I don't think you can just do it at any time. I don't blame Shen for wanting to keep an eye on Tygen. But at this point, we need all the help we can get. <laughs> That's gonna be the song you play? <laughs> like, oh uh, man, that should have been like the song you played at the end. Uh, I've never played XCOM 2. Is there more in depth like me? Yeah, definitely. Way more. Especially if you get War of the Chosen. If you're gonna get XCOM 2, don't get the base game. Get it with the DLC. Because it adds so much to the game. Like, it, 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 it makes it better. Like, it, like it just it adds more features, it adds more enemies, it adds more j just to the game. And I just think that you're missing something if you're not playing it with the War of the Chosen. Uh, but I'd also then put Long War of the Chosen on as well, which then does the same thing. It's like if another DLC came out. Uh, pain in the ass to set up, though. Let me take those weapons off. Can I do that? No, I don't want to do that. How do I strip? I just want to strip this. Oh, stri there we go. Okay, yeah, I guess. And then give him the shard gun. Then upgrade. There we go. Okay, we're gonna do... Three reloads. There we go. There we go. Let's go load out. Yeah, it's it's pretty sick. I I have a uh, long war of the chosen plus forty mods, or so thirty nine mods plus war of the chosen, right? Well, actually, technically, war of the chosen has like three or four mods on it, so I have like thirty four mods. Uh, separate from it that just add extra like quality of life things or cosmetic things to the game I just I thought it was nice Oops shit There we go Damn bro Is it me? Hell yeah, motherfucker. I'm the last one <laughs> You know what I'm talking about I know it's not a good thing, but <laughs> Yeah, but I'm the only soldier, so it doesn't matter if I'm in perfect condition or not. Okay, we're good. Uh, I would play uh, it with War of the Chosen with it. Because it doesn't expand, like, it doesn't add anything, like, at the end of the game, like, on, right? It, it changes the actual game itself and adds to it. I would play it with that. Definitely think I should. But, I mean, it's just my personal opinion. Obviously, you can play however you want. Uh, I would just play myself with it all together. Because it, it doesn't change the game drastically, right? To where, like, it's a whole new game like Long War the Chosen does. It just does make changes to the game. Uh, what am I doing now? Two 
Two days. Two days. Two days. Okay, yeah, so I think I can make it here and do that. Eastern Europe. Yeah, no problem. Uh, like I said, though, if you really want to play it just base game, you can. There's nothing wrong with that. Oh, I'm alive! The just made contacts with another group. Work for his masters in this area. Um, no, not Lachlan. I don't, who's Lachlan? <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna launch all my missions now so I don't forget about them. And plus, I need the intel anyways. Arnold, the one that died? <laughs> oh no, poor Arnold. <laughs> yeah, I mean, most likely. The aliens have had long enough to establish their peaceful enclaves within the city centers. It's time we move in and show them the fight isn't over yet. We're deploying to hit a high profile target. One that they won't be able to cover up so easily. Move to secure the target site and eliminate any hostile contacts in the area. Menace 1-5. We have a fix on the target. Move to place the exit. This guy spotted somebody. Designated position. Oh, Juggernaut. It's been a while since I've seen you. I have eyes on the enemy. Shit, okay. Okay, we're gonna go left. Got it covered. Because I want to take that drone, uh, not the drone, the, um, mech out. We'll take the drones out if they get close. Not a huge priority. Ah, uh, they have a priest. Fucking priest. Eyes on hostile patrol. And another mech. <laughs> They have a lot of, like, crowd control enemies here. Surprise, motherfucker! See how much I'm checked. Now, I suck it up, too. I have a stop. Hey, what's up? How you doing, buddy? Yeah, that's right. He, avoid them and walk right into my trap card. Position compromised. There we go. What did you expect? I'm all over it. Location confirmed. <laughs> really? Am I doing that well? <laughs> Damn, bro. <laughs> Me, I will not let you die, Halo. <laughs> Edwind is here. Me whispering as I'm killing enemies, it's only over when it's over. <laughs> Moving to designated coordinates. Whoops. Fucking right, a crit and did 11 damage. Tired of waiting around. Oh damn. <laughs> hey, Halo, don't let me die like this. Suppressing fire on target. Shown on Tavix. Minus mm. one five, you're near the target position. Natürlich. There we go, we're making it, we're making it. What? How do they keep getting out of this? Okay, that time it did hit, but I was like, I was like, they've avoided my fucking area suppressions like an ass ton, and I don't know how they're doing it.
Yeah, I heard, bro. You're getting out alive. You're putting the, you're putting up that good fight. <laughs> Motherfucking G hit. Bombs away. There we go. This is gonna hit both enemies. Oh, my perk biggest boom kicked in with a crit. Let's do this. Uh, okay. It, if you haven't played it yet, I would say skip straight to just putting uh, long war on. But he here's the thing: it really depends, like, if you're okay with difficulty or not. Or not, you know. Um, I would say. Sorry, it's a loud ass gun. Who's keeping score? I'll say my recommended uh, recommendation for what to start with on XCOM 2, at the very least, is War of the Chosen DLC included, and then I play on rookie or veteran difficulty. Um, if you want to play with the mod, which does add, like, it does make changes to the game itself, like with features and everything, it's what I'm playing, which I think is really cool and it's really nice. Um, I would then, you know, take the time to put that in, uh, and then I'd also, uh, put it on rookie difficulty to play that. Kein problem, boss. Because with War the Long War of the Chosen, it's recommended to play a difficulty or a di two difficulties down from what you'd normally play. So I'd slap, uh, I'd slap it on rookie just because. No need to ask twice. What you, what's up, Halo? Oh my god. Oh shit, I forgot there was a guy there! <laughs> It also depends on like how long you want the matches to last too. Like if you, Let's move uh, if you normally play in rookie, just know it's gonna be a, a little bit harder. <laughs> I think you, I think you'll be fine though. You might die a couple times, but it's just like standard. I, I honestly think playing it with Long War the Chosen included makes the game a lot better. There we go. Oh, uh, it's doing the glitch where it, it's playing the animation for planting the bomb, but it's not actually showing it. <laughs> and then it's gonna play it, the bomb exploding, but not show it. X4 module is armed. Neutralize any remaining hostile contacts. Absolutely. I wonder if I can hit him from here. I don't think. Oh wait, I do have a snipe. No, I don't think you're a sniper. Here I come. There we go. They might be able to hit now. No. Overwatch. Oh yeah. Das kann ich machen. Damn. Bestätigt. Überwachung läuft. Heading out. I have faith in you. That completely missed. So you going to bed after you either lose or not, or? Oh, okay. Hostile neutralized. Area is secure. There you go. We did it. We completed it. Scanners are clear. Status confirmed. Squad is clear. Detonating charges. Did he succeed? That's that's insane. He tried to melee five times and missed each time. You had some good luck there, bro. Twenty years of peace and prosperity will not be undone by the. Yeah, as I was saying, uh, long war makes the game a lot longer. So if you if you don't want your game to be a lot longer or harder, then I wouldn't play with long war. Uh, I played it like once or twice, but it wasn't really my good thing. I'm there, not a huge Clay. fan of RTS We're games. Closer to it, it's a, there's very few games that I like that are similar to this. Man, you were streaming like what, 40 minutes longer than me? Three hours and 40 minutes, almost four hours. Yeah, man. 
Oh, nice. I just got a... What? What's Dark Alliance? Oh, September. You're getting that? Oh, no, never mind. It's this month, isn't it? I have no idea. Oh, really? You know it comes out in the Game Pass. I never got around to asking okay. you, Doctor, but uh, what exactly did you do before the invasion? At one time, I was employed as a biochemist in the pharmaceutical industry, Ew. <laughs> mainly researching vaccine production techniques. Because of my background, I was rounded up by Advent and put to work in one of the very first gene therapy clinics. I saw firsthand what their technology is capable of, for better or worse. I, say we're lucky to <laughs> I knew US. why. <laughs> I appreciate the sentiment. <laughs> oh, God. Adult things. <laughs> uh, what are we doing now? We're almost done with clearing this machinery, which is nice. What? <laughs> Why are you still laughing, bro? Oh yeah, what was it? Don't, <laughs> don't, <laughs> you stay, you stay out of that. You, you, st you stay in your dark zone over there. You know they're coming out with a uh, uh, Tom Clancy's Division Heartland, which I think might, don't quote me on this, it might be free to play, I'm not sure. To establish their peaceful it is? Okay. Oh, so you know about it then. Yeah. It's time we move in and yeah. show them the fight isn't over yet. We're deploying to hit a high profile target, one that they won't be able to cover I don't know. up so easily. I'm kind of interested in Move to secure the target site and eliminate any hostile contacts in the area. Menace 1-5. I mean, it's we nothing that isn't target. new. Move to place the X4 charges at the designated position. Nah, I doubt it. Microtransactions haven't killed the game uh, in a long, like any good game <laughs> in a long while. So as long as the game's good, people are gonna play it. Closing on target position. People still play that. Roger that. No, people still play it. Moving out. Yeah. No. Oh. Yeah, but it didn't kill the game. Like. <laughs> People are still gonna play these games even if they have microtransactions or not. Microtransactions suck though, but I don't know. I'm a, I'm I prefer. Uh, see, the thing is, is like I don't care about microtransactions as long as you can earn anything you can buy in the game. Uh, I don't know. I don't know much about Charging Dark Alliance. I just prefer like I prefer earning rather than spending money for it. I don't care if somebody wants to spend money for it. Fine, but. If, if I want to be able to have also have the ability to earn uh, anything in the game. So, like, if they could buy, like, a, a gun, right, for $5, then you should be able to earn it in-game by getting, like, a certain amount of kills or doing a certain objective or some bullshit. I'm all over it. I think it was, like, what was it? Was it Halo 3 that did that? You know, where you used to have challenges that you'd have to do in story or in multiplayer, and then you'd unlock armor pieces and shit like that? Like, that was, that's, like, the best way, in my opinion, to do... Like cosmetics, Move weapons, and shit like that. Was it not three? Thought it was three. Overwatch. Yeah, because I remember the. What is it? The Ryuzaki armor? Is that what it was called? The ninja armor? <sighs> Affirmative. Will do. Location confirmed. I don't know. I'm on it. One thing I also hate, while uh, Mass Effect 1, 2, and 3 is my favorite game series, like, ever, right? Uh, while it is, uh, like I said, while it is my favorite series ever, I hated how, like, you could beat the game, and then they released DLC that was story relevant for the game after the game was already, uh, like, oh, it was like, shit, like, and if anything is gonna be like story missions or anything that's like super important that isn't like okay for instance expansions for like game story generally come after the game right i like that that's what all story related dlc should be it should be things that add after the game <laughs> uh, and then <laughs> what they did is they have like 
The first uh, game only had one DLC, which was still important to the story, or, like, for consequences, right? Uh, basically, it's like, if you didn't, uh, what Mass Effect it is, if you didn't play the DLC, everything still happened. Like, the DLC stuff still happened in the world. It's just, you didn't take part in it. So, mo most of the time, that was really bad, because it ended up being the worst case scenario. Sometimes it was neutral, and it didn't really matter. But 99% of them, between 1, 2, uh, and 3, they really mattered. They made huge differences <laughs> and shit like that, or they had really bad consequences and stuff like that. And so, if you didn't get the DLC, all of these things happened, and you just had to suffer the fact that it played it like you never took part, but all of these bad events happened. And then, if you did play the DLC, then you, you know, you could either fail it, or, you're, you're, you know, you could make your accident consequences, you know, by the choices you make, and that'd be fine. But this stuff wasn't released on uh, release of the games, so one wasn't a wasn't like DLC heavy since it had one, but like two and three had like I don't know like anywhere from like four to like ten DLCs each that had story shit related, uh, which was insane. And in one alone, that one mission was like it would kill millions and uh, millions of people. And then make a planet uninhabitable for who knows how long. <laughs> yeah, it was like a one or two dollar mission or something like that. But I don't think that was released on the release of it. And I was like, that matters. Like, there's a lot of people who like would mention and be like, oh, it doesn't matter if you play the DLC or not. And like, those people are fucking idiots. Understood. Like, it, it matters completely if you get the DLC or not. Uh, I can't throw a grenade on that guy. There we go. They're on to me. I can handle that. Hmm. Did you see that one? You're gonna have to repeat that. Oh. I don't know. I, like, obviously, like I said, that's nice and all, right? But I don't know how I feel about the game itself. Because, like, it just, it looks like, it, it looks like, you know, those Facebook games where you see, like, it look, like the visuals look really nice, but it's a, it's clearly a shit game. I guess that'll be okay. It looks, well, no, it looks nice for what it is, I guess, but I don't know. That's why I would not buy that game. I, uh, I'm completely fine just... Um, playing it okay. in the Game Pass. I, I would honestly tell you to refund it and then play it in the Game Pass, but that's just my personal opinion. I think I got a piece. What were you saying, though? Check it before you get too close. On Overwatch. Like the character Not thing. That's good, though. Right? Get ready for a surprise. I think that they're up there. Yeah, that's it's standard class stuff, right? Oops, guess he wasn't there. <laughs> well, there how about that? Oh, he was there. He did get hit. Yeah, I didn't get they're it. They're moving to flank me! I'm still waiting on you to level up your Outrider character. <laughs> I definitely got that one. Reloaded. I mean, a lot of game companies say that, dude. Okay, I'll go. I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I'm like, it seems like you're pretty hyped for the I game, but honestly, I control your hype. <laughs> The game does not look like it's going to be a super epic game. Not saying it's going to be a bad game, but it doesn't look like it's going to be a super epic game. Yeah. I mean, it's fine, but I just... I just... I, I think that it's going to be... It might... It, I think it could be a good game, right? I don't think it's going to be better than a good game, though. I think at its... Yeah, I think it's just gonna be a good game, maybe. 
But I, like, I think at its best, it'll be a good game. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? Yeah. Like, I don't think it'll be really good. I don't think it'll be epic. I, I think at its best, it'll be a good game. Uh, what I think it's really going to be, I think it's going to be a decent game. I don't think it's going to be good. I think it's going to be decent. Extraction point. Status confirmed. Squad is clear. Detonating charges. Oh, yeah. I think I've heard of that before. Yeah, uh, you. I don't, I'm not a fan of most top-down games. Even now, our enemy lurks in the shadows. Ugh. Plotting to destroy all we have built. To return us to the chaos of the old world. Only to... Our troops continue to exceed expectations while working with limited resources. Impressive, Commander. Yeah. I mean, it'd be nice if it, something good came from it. Like, it sucks when you get a game that doesn't turn out to be what you wanted to. You really hope what? Oh, you wanted to be the one? Why don't you play it then? God, I hate when they do that. It's fucking stupid. Hate that shit. I think it's stupid to release extra characters as DLC. To me, DLC uh, should be, or expansions should be story that continues the, like after the game, or anything that continues the game after it. Yeah. I don't know. It'd be like a whole like sit down thing though. You'd have to sit down and like think about like what is what, you know? So we got 24% over here. And this one right here, and this one right here. Two days. I think I can make... Did I finish making contact? I don't think I can make contact right now. No, I can't. So... Let's go to the black market. Avenger plotting new course. <laughs> Engineer costs 78 supplies. There we go. Am I building something in the proving ground right now? I'm not. <laughs> We're ready to go, Commander. If you need a skulljack, we can build one at any time. I need the officer corpse. That's what I need. Oh, I can build another spark. Look at that. I don't want to do that yet. Or do I? <laughs>
build another spark. <laughs> Leave me alone! I build what I want. That that is exactly how it goes, my friend. Don't tell me what to do. Dancing is what I do. Yeah, we're gonna counter a dark event now. What'd you say, bro? No. Oh. I thought you said something. I know that patrols. So, does that mean next time you play, are you gonna start a new campaign, or are you gonna keep struggling with the current one? Move to secure the area. Expect hostile resistance. I move. Yeah, it it does not look good at all. Justice! We are known to them. I just used the justice ability. <laughs> Launches a grappling hook at an enemy and then brings them to you and then stabs them with the gauntlet. <laughs> what? Understood. The snake. No, that's not part of it. That's a skirmisher class thing. One of the factions added by uh, the DLC. Yeah. Damn it, man. Oh, wait, wait. Yeah. Yeah. I have a tech. See if I can hack it to my side. Hopefully, she's proficient. She is. She is proficient. I'm gonna take control of their mech. Taking control. Bro, you should check out uh, my stream real quick. So I could show you, uh, not just the battle, but uh, what the map and everything looks like <laughs> for me. What? Uh, maybe? <laughs> I don't know how the Avatar project's going, so it could be going bad for me, or it could be going good for me. I'm, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, from how many contacts I have, it's nice, but I don't know how what the Avatar progress is. If the Avatar progress is low, then I'm doing good. If it's not low, then I'm doing bad. <laughs> Let's do this. I just don't know if it is. What? Oh, that had four percent. Damn it! I didn't. I shouldn't have taken that shot. I should have done another action. Yeah, I didn't get it. Absolutely. No, don't shoot at that. We're using that guy. Got it covered. I'm not. Just like Ark, bro. They're the same types of game. Oh, okay, uh, zero percent. Damn, bro. Already there. What do you mean it looks better? The visuals, you said? Well, I am on 4K graphics, you know? Plus, it's just downscaled to 1080. So, you, so I don't know if you're talking about the quality of the graphics or not. You're also mumbling, so it's hard to hear. Tired of waiting around. What are you running at, then? Some more. You don't have the mohawk as an option? Not a problem. Oh, well, I have cosmetic mods and shit like that. Affirmative. 
Negative. Covering now. <laughs> Where's the other enemy? There's five of us left? What if I, like, bomb myself? Not really, because this isn't my mech. <laughs> I hacked it. I have no idea, so I'm gonna destroy it now. It's their armor. Advent forces sighted. Hmm. Roger that. Oops. <laughs> Um, I meant to do this, but I guess we'll go here. Moving on target location. Solid copy. Move, move, move. Getting it done. Now, most likely, they're gonna target that enemy. They're like their own mech because it's under my side. Come on, you said my characters look cooler than yours? Well, they have... Well, okay, first of all, there's the red one, the one in the red armor, that's a skirmisher. So that's part of the DLC. Um, but my, but I do have uh, mods that add uh, clothing, hairstyles, face uh, paints, tattoos, etc. that get randomly thrown into the character generation pool. And shit like that. Uh, so they can be, like, they are randomized in how they look, based on that. Uh, I don't have any mods that make the world itself look, like, significantly better, you know what I mean? Um. So this is just 4K downscale to 1080 that you'd be seeing in terms of, like, the world's graphics. But I, I don't know what you mean by it looks better than yours. Here I come. Fuck. Now he's out in the open. Still moving. Heading out. Yeah. Forty six percent chance crit hit. That's right. Go here. There we go. That's gonna hit. Boom. Now where are we going? Download the ca Okay, it's this way. Oh, here we go. Yeah, so I'm about to finish this, so you'll be able to see what my map looks like. <laughs> Need to ask twice. Oh, you, you'll see. <laughs> On my way. Requesting immediate evac. This is Firebrand. Evac request confirmed. Hold tight. There we go. Boom, boom, pow, baby. Let's hack this. Look at, look at it. Recover large. Do you think I should try for the large? Or do you think I... Oh, no, reduce contact for near raid region. Never mind, I'm doing that. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna ask you, but then that one is just way too good to pass up. Successful acquisition of the advent files. Eliminate any remaining hostiles in the area. Affirmative. Moving out. The hell? This is the second time I put down a flare and it's like tossed it out. I guess, I don't know. I don't know why I did that. Requesting immediate extraction. This is Firebrand. Evac request confirmed. 
Hold tight. Position confirmed. On my way. Finally. Sure thing. Moving to Overwatch. Okay, it opened here. Good. Oh shit! <laughs> that guy's not in it. Oh, yeah, I forgot there was loot there. There we go. Absolutely. There we go. Let's call everybody out. Returning as ordered. Fox com operatives are secure. Firebrand is returning to base. Okay, now you get to see the map. Ow, my ear. What the fuck was that sound? I, don't know, I just had some sound just pop in my ear like. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Twenty years of peace and prosperity will not be undone by the reckless actions of a few misguided dissidents today. We stand with the elders. Trust in their wisdom and. To end the elders' false vision. That Oops. is the purpose of all skirmishers. Until it is done, there can be no other path for us. I've got to hand it to the aliens. The invasion was one thing. All their advanced technology. They had to drop off. No, it changes it. It doesn't up it. It like makes it different. Something we could never have prepared for. Cannot equip. With better gear. Complete blast from the past Between unlock. The propaganda, the handouts, and a seemingly endless supply of reinforcing peacekeepers. They're nothing but trouble for an upstart resistance movement. What's up? Oh yeah, wait, just one sec. I'm just switching on my weapon real quick so I can show you the map. Um, now you have a laser cannon. It's like, I have extra guns here that I'm trying to have people equip, but like, they can't equip it? Like mag shit like that, or laser shit, and they're like, they're not using it for whatever reason, or I can't give it to them or something like that, right? Oh, there, there we go, see? This guy... What do you mean you can't see anything? Yeah, like, I had to, like, find a guy who could equip the shit. There we go. You... You can't use it. Oh, that's you. That's This is your character, by the way. Yeah, that was you. No, you're alive. I, I just said that was you. That's it. You're alive. No, 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 no. The only thing that came with it is the new, uh, the new alien types. So six new alien things. So three of them, uh, all six of them. Once you kill them, they never return. Uh, and then you know a few new features. That's it. And then the three new factions, uh, the two new factions, Templars, Skirmishers, which, uh, here, let me see, I could show you, here, let me, let me go back. This is a, this is the Templars, these are the, the Templars that get added, and they get in their own ability tree. Yeah, and then, these are the Scavengers, or the Skirmishers, not Scavengers, the Skirmishers, and they get their own ability tree. So those are the two factions you get, and they each get, uh... They each get that, um... He sets all ability cooldowns on ally soldiers? Damn. Hmm. Uh... Yeah. <clears throat> so they get, they get their own thing. Okay, here. Now I can show you the map. Okay. Ready? This is what my map looks like. <laughs> yeah, I'm just... I'm keeping... I have a what? Yeah, right? <laughs> Do I?
Oh yeah, those are the people, the things that I've killed apparently. I guess that's how many things of each thing I've killed. Maybe? I think I've killed more than one mo uh, mutton though. I'm pretty sure I have though. That's the thing. Maybe I'm remembering from other campaigns? I think this is part of the normal game. You, you get that in there. But yours might be in a different area, maybe. It might be a DLC. I'm not certain. I'm not certain. Yeah, I have killed a mech. I've killed more than one mech, though. Because that other mech that was that was under my control that I killed. <laughs> I don't know if it tracks perfectly. I'm not, how it's, I'm not sure how it's tracking. It might just be, like, the amount of things that, like, I brought back. You know? The amount of corpses I brought back or something. I don't know. I had like 40 or 20 something corpses of another thing that I sold. I just need like. Oh, about that. Setting course for Sector 2, Australia. I need an officer though. I still haven't made the skull jacket. I really want it, bro. <laughs> What? Wouldn't it? What'd you say? <laughs> Bro, I did it. I'm so sad about that. I really want it. It does suck. But I need a... I think I need an, an officer corpse or some shit like that. So next time I... Oh, damn. I don't know if there's an officer in the last one. I have to remember to, like, literally pick up the body and take it with me. <laughs> I gotta take one from the battlefield, bro. <laughs> oh, this counter is a dark event, so I have to try that. Setting course for Eastern United States. Yeah, so this is the new way to set it up. Is like you you get troops. Oh, look, it's literally four people. So it's already. I I might only have four people ready to send out, maybe. Or it just chose four people. You're one of them going on that Ranger mission. Deployed. We're in the pipe. Five by five. What'd you say? We are victorious. I can put as many people, down. as many things as there's mission, and as many as I have people. Our strength but it, it's just you either raid up, attack, right yourself. You either straight up do the mission, or you infiltrate to make it easier over time. And it, you have to like, it's like, the mission's only there for a certain amount of time. Infiltration takes a certain amount of time. You want to make it to where it's like under the amount of time that the mission's there. And you can still do the mission. So it's about like finding out the amount of things. So like say a mission's like four days, right? You're going to need to put like two or three people there in order to infiltrate. But when you do that mission, you can only use those two or three people. So you got to be like, okay, can I do this mission because of the amount of people? And the lowest number of people I've seen is seven people or eight people in a mission so that how much is the most i've seen uh 28 plus <laughs> enemies if there are orders you would have us follow commander Tell what? what must be done our influence with I've, I've only won a few like two or three every single other one that i've tried doing that i lost chosen. so i don't do those anymore i always try to lower it to make it as easy as i possibly can There we go. Now with that action, I'll have each of the chosen. Oh, so you we want to see the chosen? The chosen are the three alien super alien super soldiers that are that get stronger as the time as you keep playing. So you have to kill. You can either you don't have to right, but you want to kill them before the last boss fight because the last boss fight everybody you haven't killed shows up all at once and you have to fight everything. <laughs> So basically, you can kill them before, and if you want to kill them as soon as possible, uh, these chosen. Here we go. See, they're super soldiers. Yeah, here we go. This one has moving target, uh, strengths. You get additional plus defense and plus dodge against reaction fire. Their weakness takes increased damage from reapers. Takes increased stuff. What? Yeah. Oh, so think uh, a little bit like Shadow Mortar or Shadow War, right? They like they're kind of like captain things of like that. And then, like, 
as this knowledge bar that they have increases, they get stronger, and they can eventually get rid of all their weaknesses, increase their strengths, become more overpowered. So you want to kill them, like, as fast as possible. Actually, they're, they're like this one. Uh, strengths. This soldier does not trigger overwatch or reaction fire. Uh, this one. Reaction fire shots against this one has significantly decreased chance to hit. But they sometimes have, like, really overpowered one where, like, explosive damage doesn't hurt them at all. So grenades are no longer effective against them. Rockets are no longer effective against them, etc. They're like... Oh, this really big one? Kind of looks like you. <laughs> That's a compliment. Avenger plotting it's... new course. Dude, I told you it's better with the DLC. Just check how much it, how it, you got it on Steam, right? Geo, oh Gog, just check to see if it's on sale, bro. Oh, yeah. I mean, you could just get it again and then play it with them. Setting course for what? The no, no, you just... Sector. Damn. Well, just wait for the... To war the chosen thing to go on sale. message coming through, Commander. Putting it on screen Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, now... Every single month that goes by, they gain knowledge and shit like that. And you have outdone yourself. The War of the Chosen? No, War of the Chosen just makes it harder. <laughs> and then the mod that I'm using along War of the Chosen makes it even harder. <laughs> ah, shit. Uh, we have received intel regarding the aliens' current activities. If the Resistance can detect the source of these operations, we can conduct operations to stop them. And I can only see one of them. I can't see the others. <laughs> uh, Advent incorporates defense against our hacking attempts. Damn, oh, Jesus Christ. Damn, look at- wait. Black Market pays a 20% supply premium for goods. Damn, that's pretty good. This is part of the War of the Chosen thing as well, because it adds factions. It, like, gives you bonuses to, like, things, as you can see, for, like, that month or, or for as long as you keep these supply these things on, right? Yeah, these are faction leaders that you can improve your relations with. Oh, dude, look at... No, that's a skirmisher. Well, yes, they are aliens. The, the skirmishers are previous advent who rebelled against the advent. Uh, look at this, dude. All battle madness, panic, obsession, berserk, shattered, etc. Only lasts one turn. That's, that's so cool. What do you mean? No, no, no. They broke out of it. They're, yeah, they're free now. They're, now they're fighting against it. Um. Yeah, look at that. You are the boss. Hell yeah! Two hundred and six supplies, bro. I need that. That's only Avenger one day too. Plotting new course. And now we need to make sure I'm not gonna miss anything. But see, I've already de I've already located each of the. See, because with the Chosen, you have to locate where they are, right? Then you have to take over the area where they are. Then you have to hunt them down through the covert actions, get it to part three, then find their haven, and then you have to attack their base to kill them. Uh, what they do is they'll const- If you do missions in their area, they'll constantly uh, ambush you uh, in that area, and then you have to fight them every single time they come back. And even if you defeat them in that area, they still stay alive, because the only time you can permanently kill them is by attacking their base. So you can defeat them in a mission, but they'll come back and attack you in another mission in their area. <laughs> so they could be they could be a real big pain in the ass. Like they they are the biggest pains of asses out there. Uh, like they're like their number one spot. Oh yeah. Course for Western Europe. Did what? The Chosen? 
No, I haven't actually... Actually, I think I've only fought them once right now. Sky Ranger deployed. Squad green to deploy. I don't think I've done a lot of missions in their area Avenger right now. Avenger plotting new course. I mean, I can beat them. I dev. Oh shit! This mission needs to be done now. Dude, that'd be. <laughs> I don't know what it, grenades from everybody. That that'd be terrible because most of my people only have uh, flash grenades instead of regular grenades. Because I rely on the main damage coming from e anything other than grenades, right? The grenades I use to disorientate. I don't know if you know, flash grenades, like I said, I think I said earlier, can just uh, break mind control if you hit the person who's mind controlling you with it. So you don't have to kill them to break the mind control, you can just disorientate them. Or stun them, and it'll break it. Yeah, I thought I mentioned that, but that's fine. Oh shit, there's 13 enemies here. Damn! This is the max I've done for like a low, uh... Oh damn, and I only have three people too. Yeah, but I only have two people and well, those two people are snipers. <laughs> and the mechs, I believe, uh... I don't know if you can repair them or not, but I, I feel like you couldn't or some shit like that. <laughs> not too shabby. Mm. I think we could put ourselves here and hit this the mech. Is relatively no. Overwatch. That area. I'm escorting right now a person out of here. So this is an escort mission. Oh damn, they have two mechs, two stun drones too, and a soldier. They got two mechs, two drones. The two mechs and the two drones are the most deadly things right now. Or the most, the biggest pains in the asses. They can, yeah. I'll comply. Boom! Don't you wish you oh shit! That's just- Oh my god! Holy shit, did you see that? That wrecked. Seems doable. We've got Advent here. Now we're at like the standard enemy count that I'd normally be at. Like the, I normally start like seven to eight enemies because I try to weaken my missions as much as possible before doing them so I can, you know, reduce the risk of like losing troops or taking damage and increase the chances of uh, mission success. Yeah, because I want to do everything I can to keep my troops alive. So while it can make it easy, like a lot easier by, you know, reducing the chances, that's part of the strategy, you know? And it's not like mistakes aren't effective. If I make a mistake, I fuck my ass, dude. <laughs> oh, he's good. Oh, yeah. <laughs> my fucking, uh... Robot was like, I request a kill order on the one shooting me! <laughs> we'll test the limits of that armor. Yeah, they, they have different voices depending on like... Well, you could choose the voice. And you can... But they can randomize it. What? Yeah, mine's customized. Yeah, they get their own character pool. I think they have like the standard look, like a default standard look when they're made, but then you can like change how they look. Did you see that one? You haven't unlocked it yet. Uh, and that might be DLC. I think that is DLC. It 
It, it might be. It might not be. I'm pretty sure it is, though. I'm, their target now. I'm worried about my robot being hit because I don't know if, like, you can repair it or not. <laughs> Damn. Well, how about that? Are you so As you <laughs> He needs some milk. <laughs> if only Advent knew my actual body count. Almost What'd she say? Yeah, this is going well. <laughs> yes, waste your efforts on the robot. <laughs> yes, waste your efforts on the robot. <laughs> that is what the robot said. <laughs> Primitive explosive deploying. Deoma. Ça se passe comme ça. Uh, the robot's personality? It's basically his personality is just his voice. <laughs> but yeah, you can. Already there. No, you can get. Ser are you talking about can you get serious ones or joke ones? Yeah, you can get ones that are serious. You can get ones that are straight up just robot, like a farmer dev. <laughs> <laughs> Etc. Or you can get ones that are like just super serious, like that. So they do. The, each voice for the robot has a different personality. Oh, dude, two sectoids and a muton. Damn, one armor and six crit. If I kill this uh, muton, we can check when I get back to base to see if uh, it increases it from one to two. You know. The mutant, remember it only showed one head? Damn, one armor, ten crit. Will the death of this one change anything? Guns fire bullets or lies and sometimes plasma. Did I mention I say? ammo? I'll, I'll get out alive. Very, very confident I'm gonna get out of this. I mean, I could get two of my people taken over, but I'm confident that uh, my mech will be able to uh, kill the sectoid. Um, I wonder if it can reanimate the muton, or if it can only reanimate oh, no. humans. They're shooting at me. <laughs> my robot. Oh no, they're shooting at me. <laughs> I'm reloading. <laughs> Guys, fucking chill. Now his reanimation's dead. Fucking right. Oh, is there not have an officer here? <laughs> I didn't check. Was there an officer or were they all troopers? I think they were troopers. Adjusting aim. Doesn't seem all that difficult to me. Combat effectiveness goes down without ammo. What the fuck? You're mumbling. Mm 
No, that's not necessarily true. Some of them are, some of them aren't. But it's the same, it's basically just survival of the fittest, you know, in that case. Going. Like, would you rather die? <laughs> It's not like all Advent are, like, brainwashed, but it's not like all of them aren't. <laughs> Affirmative. Yeah, there's, there's probably most definitely people who are being, uh, like, under their control. But there's probably a lot less that are than you think. Definitely gonna change his personality for the robot. Status confirmed. Mission accomplished. You say why? I don't. I don't like silliness. This is war. We this isn't supposed to be silly. Allow these dissidents to fill our hearts with fear. The victory today is a minor footnote in history. A small. A small click note. There's no way the aliens were expecting a fight like that. I'm impressed. Rainmaker. Commander. Equipped heavy weapons deal plus four damage and have increased area of effect. Damn. What we got over here? Hey, Citronelle. Thanks for the follow. Appreciate it. I think I'm going to go with the Rainmaker. Glad to see you stop by, by the way. Hopefully you're having a good day or had a great night. Yeah, we're gonna do Rainmaker as the ability. Yeah, I'm gonna do damn good. Wait, ah, oh, that's a good one. Uh, when the squad is revealed, the shoulder, uh, soldier remains concealed. Uh, no, I'm gonna get the increased. Actually, I'll get both. There we go. Because he had more points I can spend on him. Oh, yeah, that was a new engineer. Nice. Uh... There we go. I almost have- I- Literally these are the last two and I have all these things excavated. And then I can just put the engineers wherever. I don't think I'm gonna need any other engineers, will I? I don't, I don't know. I actually have no idea. Okay, yeah, let's go. Okay, it does shoot two. I guess I only did kill one in, uh, Muton in this round. Where is my spark? There you are. Okay, customize. Character info. Voice, there we go. Mm. I can see the allure of the yeah, advent the therapy clinic. A few minutes under the knife, and a better clean bill of health. Too bad you need a chip to get in. Got a stretcher somewhere? Oh, here we go. Uh. External temperature threshold exceeded. Compliance. Attempted multiple enemies targeted. A networked terminal infiltration failed. We're gonna get that one. I like the Guardian one there. There we go. Okay, let's bounce back and... Let's go check to see if there's anything we need to immediately do. Yeah, but this is why I said, like, this is... Uh... Yeah, this is why I said I think, like, playing it with the DLC is the best way to start playing it. And then I think, like, I think playing with the Long War is nice as well. I think whether you play that uh, with the DLC or Long War, either one of those is my preferred way of starting it, in my opinion. That one's got eight days. Okay, yeah, so I think I'm good on this one, yeah. Hell yeah! Setting course for That's sector a two. Australia. I didn't want to go over there! What are you taking me there? I didn't click there! <laughs> Did I? <laughs> What'd you say, bro? It did take me there anyway. Take me away to the private place <laughs> where I'm all okay and the Avatar project isn't secretly going on behind closed doors that I can't actually see. <laughs> when did you learn about the Avatar project and why am I not learning about it? <laughs> what if it's like one thing away, you know? <laughs> Can you imagine? Would you rather not know how close you are to losing, or would you rather know? I'd rather know. 
you imagine like doing everything thinking you're doing really good and then all of a sudden it's like just game over you lose earth lost <laughs> Sectoid. Communications relay is up ahead. Move in and destroy the target. Not forward, but back. Hut! Come here, my ah! We can't hide anymore. Now you're suffering. Okay, man, you have a nice night. It's cool hanging with you. That's a Templar. Templars get power. That's their skill tree thing. It's it's like psionic stuff. Like they they they're like experts in it. So they know how to use it efficiently. Some bullshit. <laughs> they have a, they have a logic thing somewhere in here. I'm just I don't care. They, they can, I'm just like you can do stuff. Good. You're part of my team. <laughs> Good copy. Moving on target. Okay, see you, dude. Mm. Oh, yeah, baby, take that. So must I sign. Roger that. Oh, he spotted somebody. Drone literally right next to where we were. What's over there? I definitely got that one. In hot mode. There we go. Let's go, Marcus Vogel. Advent Einheiten gesichtet. Zielobjekt sichergestellt. I'll go quickly. Oh, there's an officer. We need to take him. We need to take him. I gotta remember. Take the body. Take body. <laughs> I need that. Sensitive to noise. The sounds of combat are likely to draw even more of them. This is the first time I'm encountering the loss so far. And who knows how long. First time I use my face off ability. I like it. Readings are all over the place. The lost are almost right on top of you. Oh man, they're coming. They are coming. Woo! Ich bin hier festgenagelt. Yeah, your accuracy is gonna be shit because you're damaged, bro. Damn, I was hoping to blow up the car.
Whatever, we'll just fucking whoop. That's what I'm talking about. I got it right. I, I think this is the package. Shono Devix. And that's the officer body. Oh right. look, a swarm appeared. Those it's our very first time seeing the swarm. Appears, the alien devices dropped during the first invasion had a degenerative effect on these citizens. Their physical and mental health to rapidly decay while maintaining primitive organic functions. Approach with caution, command. Come on, fail, 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 fail. Uh, yes. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, take damage from that. That's what happens when you try to psionically control, bitch. Yeah, I'm so glad I got that uh, order. Sure. Who's keeping score? I'm keeping score. You can't handle me. You can't handle Rock the truth. Out of rounds. Yeah. Are oh, you bitch? Oh, I'm disorientated too, of course. Forgot about that. Get clear. Hell yeah. What the hell just happened to it? Why? Did it get hit by the lost or some shit? Scanning. My camera's frozen. Oh, there we go. Did that tear it us out? How many is that now? It. I think it did. Okay, it did tear us out of it. Looks like the stuff. Solid copy. As you direct. There we go. Let's get everybody there. Take the officer's body out. Bring in the evac. There we go. This is Firebrand. Evac request confirmed. Hold tight. I'm talking about five with confirmed destruction of the relay. The alien transmission is down. I can't Eliminate pick up the body. Hostels and move to evac. Kind problem. Oh. Bull. I guess it just gets rid of the flare Fire that you throw evac before. Hold tight. It only matters about the one you throw after you're able to evac. That's unfortunate. I was hoping to take a body back with me. Farm operatives are secure. Firebrand is returning to base. Uh, 
I wanted that corpse so I could use it. And despite the destruction left in their wake, XCOM refuses to let go of the ways of the old world. They will continue their wanton and reckless crimes. I never had any doubts about your capabilities, Commander. Excellent work as always. Hey! Once per turn, gain an additional action after taking a standard shot at flanked or exposed targets with your prime weapon. Hmm. Fire twice in a row at an enemy. Each shot suffers an aim penalty of zero. That's pretty good. Okay, we'll get rapid fire then. I wonder if these stack. The once per turn gain an additional action after taking a standard shot at a flanked, or that. There we go. How you doing, Goldilock? Uh. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. You know, uh, I probably wouldn't be alive today if it weren't for your father. He was, uh, something of a miracle worker getting the avengers power back online was a miracle i'm not entirely sure how he deciphered their system but we'd still be half buried in the sand if he hadn't he gave everything he had to get the ship running but he didn't live long enough to see her fly we owe you both a debt of gratitude you can honor his memory by using this ship to destroy the aliens wherever we find them you'll get no argument here I don't know why some of them seem to like- Oh, there we go. There's one. Some of them seem to like unequip shit every now and then, maybe. Maybe. I'm not so- I'm not certain. There we go. Another person right here. I think we're good. Uh, let's see if anybody has any like weapon upgrade slots. Oh, you do. Hey, look at that. Going good. Now. We still have covert ops going here, so we can't do much in terms of that. But we need to make sure we are not forgetting any missions. Ah, oh, resistance mech. We need to check that out. Uh, twenty-three percent there. Fifty-two. Let's go get the mech. Avenger plotting new course. It was, it was faster to go that way, really? Okay, I won't, I won't judge. Okay, we can skip that one. Mm, skip. Hmm.
it's an intel package, I guess. We're, we're close to it, so might as well. We'll need intel anyways. Go. Sky Menace ready to deploy. Avenger plotting new course. Do that one after. There we go. A resistance anti aircraft missile brought down a UFO here. Not much is left to salvage from the craft, but our team discovered an intact power down advent mech and a cargo pod thrown clear of the crash. We we're able to reset its programming directed to obey XCOM and resistance personnel, and it will be transferred to a nearby haven to assist in its defense. Wait, like it's not to me? I, I, I wanted it for me. Oh, 100 right here. Eight days on it. Okay. Okay, yeah. Um. Okay. Hell yeah, Setting make contact. Let's go. Sector 14, woo, woo, woo. East Asia. I think after that we'll have like two. Attempting to establish local regional contact. Five days? Setting okay, let's go to that. For Mexico. Commander, it would appear the aliens have sent a particularly nasty group of creatures into this area. It seems even Advent can barely control them. I would strongly advise caution. One, two, three, four. Boys. Sky Ranger deployed. In position to drop. Make Setting contact for East Asia. Seven days, two days. I was gonna keep an eye on this so I don't forget something. Oh, there's one right here. Yeah, five days. I would have missed that. There's one right here. One day. Yeah, that's gonna be close. Okay, see, I would have, man. See, I told you. 42 intel. I'm gonna ignore the two day one. Which one hit 100? You. You're at five days though. Okay. No, I'm good. I have made a number of interesting discoveries, Commander. I don't want to spend 50 supplies on that. Sorry. I'm not going to do that. I will make that our highest priority. Okay, let's go check. This is the... Uh, here. One day, five hours till it's ready. Seven day... Okay. Yeah! Yeah! I'm not gonna get another one, because I want the Skulljack, and I need the Advent Officer Corpse. For some reason, I can't get it. Time 
Lab construction initiated. There we go. Don't have any free here. Uh, let's go to, we haven't checked you in a while. I'm just checking what I can build. You know, it's been a little bit. Look at that, ballistic shields. I gotta like start focusing on like, once I capture all, all the areas for, use all my intel, you know, to capture the uh, havens, I'm gonna focus on only things that give me supply. And then intel will just come with it, I am assuming. Oh, okay, this is for each of them. Not plated regular? Okay. What do you know about these gene therapy clinics, Doctor? They seem like a big draw for the cities right now. Having worked in one of the facilities, I can tell you firsthand. They do offer a level of medical care unmatched by any previous effort in our history. The aliens have effectively cured all of humanity's greatest ailments. Cancer, malaria, AIDS. The process is relatively simple. As long as you're compliant. Yes. The price of admission is acceptance of all Advent policies. For many people, that's hardly a consideration. A minor inconvenience at most. I'm beginning to see the appeal. There's been plenty of gripes about my flying, but I don't see anybody else stepping up, other than the autopilot. There we go. Oh wait, no, it might need some upgrades. Nope. Oh, that's what those are for. Oh. oh, I was wondering why those weapons weren't being used for other people. He's out on a mission. <laughs> I can't even make it to that one. No point of even trying to go there. Six days still. Not gonna be able to make that one. We can make that one. Setting course for the That's Western 10 days. European ward. That's a good amount of time.
Sky Ranger deployed. In position for deployment. Damn, we are going for that one. Damn. For the Australian supplies sector. and intel. Ranger deploy. Squad green to deploy. We're gonna ignore that. Still at six. Four. Setting course for sector fourteen, East Asia. Something hit a hundred, but which one? You. You need to be launched right now. <laughs> oh my god. Literally a second more and it would have been like uh, lost the mission. Wasted efforts of my team. Received the priority one transmission from the spokesman. The resistance has a VIP operating out of this area in need of immediate extraction. Advent forces are on alert nearby. Be prepared to engage and eliminate any hostile contacts. Secure the area and escort the VIP to safety. Menace one five, target coordinates incoming. I like how they're sitting on the extraction. To the evac volume for extraction. Advent already knows we're here, so your position isn't concealed for the extraction. Whoops, it's the guy I'm, uh, trying to, trying to have escape. Oh, no. <laughs> Fear my mark. Fear my rapid hit. I will hit you one of these times. Thank you. Hostile terminated. Come get some. Oh yeah, take that crit, bitch. On your order. Bad place to be with no cover. Intel located. X-ray neutralized. Bitch. Still moving. <laughs> oh. Target neutralized. Die. I'm on it. Damn it! If you're gonna surprise attack him, at least hit.
Man, none of my people have a fucking A good decision. There we go. Take this bitch. Deflection. Just activated my trap card. On the margins. Located. Hustle target down. Oh yeah. Who's keeping score? Only Wingdom. Look, it's another officer. I need him. <laughs> I need you, bitch. <laughs> Got it. Ready to go. Last one's got to be a drone, right? <laughs> oh, they're all dead. Never mind. I thought there was one more. <laughs> like one more after one more. I'm not even going to make that one. As you direct. Uh... Oh, I can't. I can make this one. Oh, wait. No, that wasn't even the right guy. I can't make it. That was the... Damn it. I lost both of them, but that's fine. I think most of my units have stuff on them anyways. Why can't I pick up the body? <laughs> Let me do it. Moving out. Got it. I need that trooper body. Go, go, go. That seems reasonable. Stepping off. Mission accomplished. I would like to assure the citizens of Advent that our peacekeepers will stop at nothing to prevent further attacks by criminal elements such as the one that occurred today. The elders have totally... Glad to see our new recruits aren't hesitating when it comes to taking out the aliens. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. My followers remain in disbelief that any who once served the elders could ever truly defy their false gods. We remain wary of their kind. But for now, their quest for vengeance serves our purpose. Okay, let's pause that and save.
There we go. I'm gonna pause and I'm gonna go to the bathroom, guys. And then, you know, grab some water and I'll be right back. <laughs> 